Hi guys, I'm excited to bring you another unboxing video of a robot kit that I got from China. This is the Robosol H3S Humanoid Robot and uh, it came from the same manufacturer that I got my hexapod from. And uh, you're actually looking at the brochure here that comes with the kit but uh, unfortunately there aren't much information inside here and uh, everything is in Chinese. So if you can't figure it out like me, you probably need to get a friend to translate it for you. Okay, uh, without wasting any time, let's look at what's inside the box and I can say that I'm pretty surprised to see the uh, manufacturer has actually stepped up in its packaging. As you can see, everything is well placed in uh, compartments. Um, and all these brackets, as you can see, these are the brackets for the legs, these are for the arms. Um, they are all being placed uh, in plastic bags to uh, prevent any uh, scratches and let's take a look at this uh, these are the hands of the robot okay and uh, this is the back plate this is where it houses all the MCU and the components and this is the head of the robot okay it looks like a crash helmet uh, And this is the chest plate. Okay, this is where it will cover the battery. And it doesn't have a pattern here as uh, as shown in the brochure, but uh, I think it doesn't matter. Okay. Here are the wire tubes, screws, wire holders, and these are the feet the base plate for the feet and I must say they are pretty big and at this point in time I can't really tell how tall the robot will be so I guess I will only know um, after I have assembled it okay let's put it back together these are the servo cables the shoulder plates and this is the chest plate, the internal chest plate where we place the, where we mount the uh, servo controllers and the battery together. And let's let's look at what's in here. Okay, this is the MP3 module, and looks like they throw in a uh, SD card as well. And the MP3 module comes with a speaker. Hopefully, it's loud enough. And the next thing, this is the Bluetooth module, okay, and uh, I understand this is supposed to be mounted uh, inside the head. Okay. Now, there are four colors that comes with this robot, uh, blue, red, yellow, and uh, white, uh, but I kind of fancy the red, so uh, that's why I got this one. And I think, yep, there's another layer at the bottom. Let me remove this. Okay, surprisingly, this is pretty light. Okay, so I'll just put this aside. Okay. Now, at the second layer, we have a clone version of a PS2 controller. As you can see, there's no Sony logo here. And uh, there's a receiver that comes with it. A USB cable for the servo controller. Okay, this is a 16-channel servo controller. All right, uh, that's because our robot is a 16 degree of freedom uh, robot, and uh, this uh, servo controller is known to have uh, all the protection for overcurrent, so which is a uh, pretty good. Okay. Uh, okay, this is the light polymer battery. Just gotta be. Uh, Got to be very careful with this. Okay. Okay, this is the light polymer charger. And gosh, I'm looking at this in horror. Okay. Uh, the last time I sorted this out for my hexapod, it took me about an hour. I guess I'm going to go through all that fun again. All right. Okay, these are the servo horns. Um, two of them are silver in color. 
So I guess they are probably for the shoulder or arms. I'm not very sure. Okay. Uh, the rest are all servos. Okay. And uh, okay, these are LDX two two seven biaxial servos, and I believe these are two hundred and twenty seven as uh, uh, two hundred and seventy degree uh, servos. Okay. And I'm supposed to have four of these. And the rest are actually LDX218 servos. Uh, also biaxial but uh, 180 degrees. And if you have followed my hexapod video, you will know that uh, these are pretty good servos that you can just use with the servo controller uh, without any bug chip because it comes with some intelligent chip inside. Okay. So there you have it, the RoboSo H3S Humanoid Robot. Now I'll be working on this for the next few days and I hope that uh, I'll be able to do a video after I finish the assembly. I hope you like this video. Thank you and do subscribe. Bye!